So the last thing that we're gonna do is a two-step Cruyff pullback, all right? So simply put, all we're doing is combining from the last thing that we did where we did a two-step Cruyff, our knees are bent, we're protecting the ball, pulling out, and then the last thing we're gonna add is, is if we were gonna go that way and then pulling back into our body and then inside of the foot getting out the opposite way. All right, so the keys to this, uh, let me have you come up here really, really quick, okay? So all the deception is in the hips. So in the very first step, you're making me believe that you are gonna go that way, okay? So that whenever I commit as if you're going that way, you're pulling away from me. For step two, you're pulling it back out and if the defender stays with the attacker, that's whenever I come back in and then she's coming back out and getting back into the space that she originally wanted. So really emphasize on step one, pulling it back and catching it hard, okay? Ready, step one. Very good. Notice everyone here should be able to move it right now with the bottom of their foot. Again, it's so important that you can change your mind in any second. Step two, pulling out. Hips should be facing out. Knees should be bent. Knees should be, can you bend your knees even more? Because that's gonna give you more explosiveness getting out, okay? Here we go. And step three, pulling back in, light on your toes. So what she just asked is, should it be tight? First, I want you to show me the two different ways that you're talking about, okay? So a tight one, this is the way a tight one would look. Go ahead and go, good, good. So everything was extremely tight and close to her foot. Go ahead, now, now do one where it's bigger pulls. Go ahead and go, good, good. Good. So I, I've always said that you want to find that balance of how far can you pull the ball out. The further that you can push it out, that's the more that you're going to commit the defender and the spaces uh, around the defender. So you have to find that balance of how far can you push it with, with keeping it fast. Okay, good. Go ahead. Go. Good. Which that's still super, super quick. So again, I would say that's okay. What you don't want to do is you don't want to get those far pulls, but then you become super, super slow because in that moment, you've just lost all your momentum. Okay, does that make sense? So find that balance. How far can you push it and pull it with staying super, super quick? All right, here we go. Ready, and go. Light on your toes, good. Go. Go. And relax. 